Hi everybody, this is Ann Emery with Excel for Evaluation. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix funny looking line charts with a feature called Switch Row and Column. So here's the data set that we're working with. We've got the ranks of faculty members right here, professor, associate, assistant, etc., and date ranges across the top, fall 2001, fall 2003, etc. And we have the number of professors who were employed at each of those given time points. A fellow evaluator sent me this data set and she wanted to make a line chart showing how many faculty members were employed over time to see if there were any patterns or trends between fall 2001 and fall 2009. So let's insert our line chart. I'll show you how we did it. So we're going to select almost the entire table, everything except the total, go up to the insert tab, go over to line, and just select this first option, the 2D line chart. So this is what happened to us when we tried to insert the line chart. We really wanted to have the dates across the bottom and the roles over here in the legend. We needed these to be switched. So here's what we did first to try to switch this up a little bit. First we just copied and pasted the data table. So we selected the entire table, copied it, and I'll show you how to transpose the data using paste special. So just select the new cell where you want to paste the data go up to the paste icon, click this little down arrow, go down to paste special, click on values and transpose and watch what happens. I'll move this out of the way so you can see it a little bit better. So before we had the date ranges across the top of the table and now we have the date ranges right down here, down the side on the rows. So let's try inserting our line chart again and we'll see if this different format of the data table solves our problem. So again, let's select almost the entire table, everything except the totals, go up to the insert tab, go over to line, and select this first option. Hmm, okay, and this is what happened to us too. We got the exact same thing. So we had the roles of the faculty members here and we still have the dates on the side. So no matter how we formatted our data table, we get the same funny looking line chart. So let's just delete this second one because that sure didn't work. And let's delete this data table. And then I'm gonna show you the fastest way to solve this. So we're gonna click on the chart itself. And when you click on it, you get three new tabs, chart tools, design, layout, and format. We're gonna go under the design tab and go over to this icon that says switch row and column. It swaps the data over the axis. It's kind of like transposing. Watch what happens. There we go, that's exactly what we wanted. Now we have the dates across the bottom and we have the roles right here. And we can see um, if there are any patterns over time. So there you go, that's how to fix funny looking line charts with a feature called switch row and column. Thank you very much.